this is the best optimization guide for the new season 4 you get at least 10% FPA boost and no more stutters after this video so starting off with the most basic changes Alright guys, the first method I want to show you to actually improve your FPS is by using the NVIDIA app. A lot of pros are using this NVIDIA app, such as Lix, Peterbot, and pretty much every single pro that uses a GeForce GTX GPU. Okay, so you could, I'm, I'm gonna have a link down in the description so you could go ahead and download this straight out of my description. First thing we need to do guys, is obviously update our drivers. So go over here on the drivers. Um, tap right here and click on install pretty much updating my uh, drivers which you should do it every single time all right guys so now that this has actually been installed what you need to do is obviously i'm not gonna restart it now and there's another thing that we need to do right now so the first thing you need to do is go over here on your settings and basically what i want you guys to do is copy every single one of my settings all right but the second step i want to show you is basically you hold the windows button plus r and you're gonna see this little uh, tab right here so what you need to do is just type in system properties performance dot exe and just click on okay just like so and you're gonna see this little this window is gonna pop up okay so the next thing you need to do is go over here on adjust for best performance switch over to adjust for best performance all right boys so the third tip in my opinion is going to help you the most so what you need to do is open up your google home and just type in geforce geforce gpu just like so and you could pretty much open this um w this website okay and you could see how kinds of gpus so shut your broke ass up and literally buy a better gpu bro <laughs> all right guys another thing that i want to show you is go over here on your search bar and just type in settings just like so and go over here on gaming and go over here on game mode okay? personally i have this disabled because i don't really see that big of a difference but depending on how bad your gpu is you might see a slightly a slight better performance so go ahead and just i don't know enable this just experiment exp eh, experiment and the next thing you need to do is go over here on accessibility go on visual effects and basically disable the transparency effects and the animation effects the fifth tip i have for you is opening your game mode again but this time going to related settings and click on graphics okay the first thing you need to do is click on change default graphic settings and uh, hardware accelerated gpu scheduling me personally i have disabled but you could apply this just go back and click on browse right here and locate fortnite i'm not going to be doing this right now because i have fortnite right here so what you need to do is just left click on it click on options click on high performance and just click on save that is literally it guys all right boys so we're slowly progressing our way to the most advanced settings basically what you need to do is is go over here on the settings and copy the settings that i have right here basically desktop notifications show free games notifications show news and special offer notifications measure that these are ticked throttle down throttle downwards measure you untick this and pretty much enable anything i have right here all right boys another thing that i want to show you is go over here on library and locate fortnite click on these three dots right here and click on options just like so and as you guys can see you have fortnite installation options and i i could assure you that you're gonna have most of these settings ticked on so basically what you need to do is disable the fortnite save the world high resolution textures and direct x 12 shaders keep pre-download stream assets and fortnite core and battle royale obviously if you use the fortnite the save the world just click this because otherwise you're not gonna have a save the world installed but if you don't use it just you're gonna free up space anyway so that is gonna make your pc a little bit run a little bit faster high resolution textures this is just like making your game more beautiful but we don't want that we want performance and DirectX 12, 12 shaders basically it's self-explanatory works only with DirectX 12 and yeah you don't need that so just untick it and click on upload all right guys so we're going to the most advanced settings that i could show you but before we start i want you to go over here and create a restore point just like so in case anything happens now go over here and just click on create and name it whatever you guys like click on it and wait for it to right so it's successfully created and the next thing we need to do right now guys is open up your registry just like so okay guys so what you need to do is when you open the registry uh editor what you need to do is just click on export and name it whatever you guys like 
Just like so. And the next thing we need to do, wait for it to load, okay? Okay, so now when I got the creator, what you need to do is expand the computer, expand HP local machine, and what you need to do is just find system right here. The next thing you need to do, which is right here also, expand control and the last thing we need to do right now is find priority control which should be around right here okay and what you need to do right now guys is right now guys is right click on the win32 priority set just like so i click it type in 1a just like so and that is literally it what you need to do is just uh close this page the next thing we need to do right now is open up window powershell as an ad administrator because i will show you one setting that will actually help you a lot so basically once you guys have opened it please make sure you open it as an administrator and just gonna put this link right here i'm gonna have it down in the description just right click on it okay so this little window is gonna pop up this is the ctt weeks right now guys so go over here on your tweaks and what you need to do is click on add and activate automate performance profile just click on that all right so what you want what i what, what i want eh, what i want you guys to do right now is copy my tweaks as you guys can see and again click on add and activate ultimate performance mode and once you guys are done what you need to do is go over here on run tweaks the next thing you need to do is go over here on updates and it is it is recommended to use security recommended settings but if you don't want delayed features then you can just switch over to default our box all right guys so once you have this done what you need to do is just like close this window and just restart your pc all right guys the final settings i want to show you are actually in the fortnite settings so basically as you guys can see i'm running about 300 fps at the start of the video i was running about 280 looking at this guy well it's not really that big of a difference but yeah it still made a slightly bigger difference okay okay so the first thing we need to do is obviously these are some basic settings everybody should know this rendering mode you should turn this on performance and pretty much as i see for the video settings audio settings what you need to do is go over here on the subtitles this has also been confirmed by Booger that this actually boosts your fps a little bit subtitles of text size extra small text color white text border none a background cap, cap opacity clear but i'm stuttering so yeah. i want to show you guys are actually in the game settings energy saving turn both of these on off and uh, re record replays make sure for these four settings right here are also turned on off but i just use them for my thumbnails or when i record a video i just use them so that's why i have them off and it's actually these 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 settings the energy saving and the replays actually do work so yeah it's confirmed and yeah this is pretty much right, boys, really hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know down in the comments if these settings actually helped you a little bit because they're in fact gonna help you so it's been your boy chopper and as always peace out and i'll see you guys next time